Hello, and welcome back to Yonderella. Last time we ran into a burgundy-haired tsundere and a blue-haired girl who has no idea what personal space is. Sounds interesting enough, might as well continue. Hello, bunny. There are emails from Hanoka and Hinata. I'm gonna wait for you at the... at the pier. I'll whack you if you don't come. Come to the secret base. I'll be waiting for you. Well, so far, Hanoka creeps me out less. Screw it. I'll go with that again. Not too sure why. <sighs> I did say burgundy haired earlier, right? Last time I accidentally said mahogany. Oh, so you came. Yatoro? Say something funny. Uh... <laughs> So a dyslexic man walks into a bra. Fuck. Don't just sit there quietly. Say... something. If life gives you ballads, you're probably dyslexic. God damn, what is it? Fuck. Ugh. Okay, look, here. Take them. What do you mean, what are they? They're cookies. Ugh. You mean you don't remember? I used to make them for you all the time. How could you not remember? Jerk. Well, not only did I not get punched, but I also got cookies. I went through the trouble of making them, so don't let any of, so don't let any go to waste. You did this for me. Do you like me? Eh, my reaction would probably be you. You did this for me. I mean, this is me we're talking about. Why? I might have this. Sh I. I <laughs> oh boy. Enough about my insecurities. You did this for me. Uh, no, it's not like they're for you or anything. They're for your mom. Yeah, yeah, she's always helping me out and stuff. So, so be sure to give them to her, all right? Uh, jeez. Don't get the wrong idea, okay? These are just a token of my appreciation. Yeah, no one was buying the mom's story. Well, they'll be going then. See you tomorrow. Not really that I hate the Sundere, it's just that it's usually overdone and poorly implemented. It's night. Luckily, still no break-ins. Today was really fun. We got cookies! I also went to a... Uh, I also got to eat burgers. A really good day. What kind of day will tomorrow be? Hopefully not a terrible one. Quietly close my mind... Quietly close my eyes with that thought in my mind. English, yes, first language. Third day. With our ominous music still here. <clears throat> there he Uh, it's morning. I live in a one-story house. Why does my window have a balcony? A new email has arrived. It's from Hinata. Way to get the park. Let's all go somewhere together. Looks like it came around 30 minutes ago. I should probably hurry up and get to the park.
Bunny. Bun Chen. I offer my save point in our services throughout the nation. Actually, with the name I'm giving him, it probably should be Bunny Senpai. Yes, Bun Senpai. <laughs> See, we have Lenore and Bun Senpai. I'm totally okay with this. Care to save? Yes. Yes, I do. Let's go. Oop, doop, doop, doop. No, that's not the park. This is the park. Park. Da 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 da. And now the quieter music. More somber music. Good morning, Yotaro. Morning. You're late again. Well, you kept me up all night. So what did you get to treat us to today? Cut him some slack, Noka. I'm gonna pay for everything today. Well, luckily, I am a complete doormat. Jeez, you're such a goody two-shoes, Hanada. Alright, never mind all that. I don't want you to treat me. Sorry. Don't worry about it. Nothing to apologize for. Okay. No, okay. Anyway, Anata said she wants to go to the, an arcade. Holy shit, an arcade. I need to go to an arcade. If there's one around here, I'm sure it's going to be in the station. Of course, you are coming along, right? Fuck yeah, an arcade. I'm going. Yes, yes, definitely, Arcade. Of course you are. Now let's go. Off we go. Oh, that's the wrong button. So everything is at the goddamn station. Huh. Don't skip. Interesting. And I'm guessing that this means that now something that is going to f determine what ending we get is now going to happen. That's my guess. We're here. This place is pretty big. Yeah, but it's not that big compared to the one in Tokyo. I'm pretty sure there's more than one arcade in Tokyo. Really? Wow, Tokyo's awesome. I've never even been there once. So, what did you want to do here again? Oh, um, um, I don't have a camera, so this. A photo booth? Wow, that takes me back. Look how high tech these are. Yeah, you can even draw on them with a pen. Let's do this together. It's been so long since we've been able to get together like this. Okay, okay. It's kind of embarrassing, but let's take some photos as a keepsake. I'm gonna I'm gonna be honest here, I have never been in a photo. <laughs> oh, that is a terrified face. <clears throat> Alright, here you go, Hinoka. This one's yours. Oh yeah, I forgot you have to tear them off. Thanks. And here's one for you, Yutaro. I'm gonna take it. Thanks. No problem. <laughs> now we all have one. This is my first picture that has all three of us together. That makes this pretty valuable. Thanks, Sonata. <laughs> You're welcome. Hmm. Ah. So cute. <laughs> There's a crane game with Bun Senpai in it. I want to win Bun Senpai. It's a crane game with a stuffed bunny inside. I want it, but. It looks kind of hard to get. Yeah, it does. Let me try. Oh, 
Oh. Nope, I can't. Arm's too weak to pull it up. Let, let me try it. No. I don't think we'll be able to get it. It looks like it's going to be really hard to wriggle it out of there. Katuru, you try it too. Not even like a, I get to choose. Okay, but you're paying. <laughs> Do I get back at this? Nah. Fine, leave it to me. Good luck, Yuturu. This time, I tried my hand at it. Amazing! How would you do it? Nothing gets between me and Bun Senpai. <laughs> you thought one of them was the odd race. No, I am. Towards Bun Senpai. Wow. You're a real piece of work. I'm impressed. We got the bunny. Great. What now? Give it to Hanoka, give it to Hinata, or keep it for yourself. Okay. Earlier it said skip to decision. I'm guessing this is the decision. So, I'm going to do all three in order. Because might as well. So, alright, first one. Give it to Hanoka. Ah! Cinderella is supposed to have a happy ending, right? Oh, happy end, right. Uh, breathing in my ear. <laughs> huh? Well, I'm dead. For, for me? You can have Bun Senpai. That kind of stuff doesn't really suit me. Give it to Hinata. I have a death wish. Wh what? What's with that look? Well, this kind of thing doesn't happen every day, so I guess I'll accept it. Not, not, not that I'm happy or anything, not one bit. But I still have my bun, senpai. Care to save? Yeah. So, I'm gonna have to go to slot 5 after this. Emails from an oak. Waiting at the pier? Our usual spot, okay. Gonna go to the pier again. Oh! Yotoro. And we get the sparkle effect sound. You came. You seem out of it. Huh? What do you mean? There's nothing wrong with me. You saying there is? You dumbass. <laughs> Baka! <coughs> oh, sorry. <coughs> my, my body is rejecting the tsundere. There's nothing bothering me. Uh, I'm not worried about anything at all. Like getting stabbed by the blue-haired one. I mean, Hanada. <sighs> hey, I've been thinking about telling you this, th telling you this for a while. You want to know, don't you? Why well, I used to go over to your house to play every day? The truth is... It wasn't really because I wanted to talk to your mom. I just wanted to be with you again. Oh, well ain't that sweet. And kinda creepy. I find every... 
I, I honestly kind of find all displays of affection creepy. Well, towards me creepy, anyway. Boy, do I have issues. Uh, I... Hmm. You know, there's probably something deeper underlying all that, but right now I'm just kind of wasting time when I should be doing this. I wanted to talk to you again. Surprised? Eh, uh, no, I could have predicted that. <laughs> yeah, don't know what you're talking about. Yeah. <laughs> of course, it's been so long after all. I love you. I really, really do. So much it hurts. You might want to see a doctor. Ever since we were little, you've been the only boy I cared about. Now that's kind of concerning. People usually aren't that one-track minded. It's okay. You don't have to give me your reply right now. Oh, wait. <laughs> I'll wait. I'll wait for you. Well, good night. Ugh. Uh, the same horrifying curtains. It's night. Did I do the right thing? Probably not. Picking one out of two of them would be... Like rubbing dirt in the other's face. But I picked one. Even though there are no do-overs in life, I went and picked one. Nah. Now, no matter how it turns out in the end, I'm sure. I'm sure the three of us won't be able to stay together anymore. Our precious days, people, daily lives. What kind of day will tomorrow be? Boy, that got dark. I quietly closed my eyes with that thought in my mind. And didn't flub the reading this time. Oh, hi there. Cinderella. Even though she was more beautiful, more kind, more precious, more cheerful than any everyone else. Well, that's kind of vain. It never did her any good. Her sisters worked her to the bone every day. She was unable to go to the ball, unable to meet her prince. All she could do was clean. Mr. Clean, a princess covered in cinders. Wait. Cinderella has a happy end, right? Well, if we're going by the grim fairy tale, that's a interesting definition of happy. I am the princess. It's supposed to have a happy end, right? This isn't fair. I've been taken to this dirty city far away from my prince. Well, there are a lot of people in Tokyo, so I can understand it being called dirty. I mean, kind of like New York's dirty. N New York City. And Chicago. Chicago. Wow. All because of my parents. I have been a straight-A student. I, no, I have to be a straight-A student. I have to be a good girl. Why? Because I don't want people to get mad at me? Because I don't want to be bullied? I have to study hard every day. I live every day in fear. I... I'm going to break away from all this and go see my prince. I don't want to wait anymore. Uh... Was that flashback or recent? Huh. Am I a bad person? Even though I know how Nada feels, I still... Hmm. I wonder what y why Yotaro gave me the stuffed toy. You creeped me out less. Is it was be... They <laughs> Is it because he was too embarrassed to give it to Hinata? But, in the end, he gave it to me. He looked at me for once. No. 
This is bad. I can't go to I can't get together with the person I like if it means betraying my best friend. Three-way? I'm sorry. I just can't do that. I mean, Hanada is my best friend. She's precious to me. Sure, there are times when I felt like I kind of hated her a little. We are rivals in a way, but... Uh, what should I do? Oh, Jesus. You idiot. How about you just be honest with yourself? Uh... Hmm. Who was that? It's me. My reflection in the water is speaking. You might want to go to a doctor. Who are you? I'm me, of course. But forget about me. Are you a dumbass? Oh, great. She's even abusive to herself. Friends are worthless anyway, so just shut up and, and take Yotaro already. Well, shut up. Be alone. You really are stupid. Don't you get it? Hinata was hoping for you to lose, you know. She pretended to be your friend while warning you to back off. Remember how she had taste history. Remember how she wanted you to cheer her on. Don't tell me you didn't even notice that. Shut up. Come on, quit trying so hard. Give yourself a break already. Wow. Her alter it is a dick. You knew how much Hinata you loved Yotaru. And yet, Yotaru still chose you. Uh... He... chose me. That's right. You should be happy ab That's right, you should be happy about it. The feelings you've been harboring for a painfully long time have finally reached him. You know what I said that you creeped me out less? I might have to take it back. That's right. I'm sure I want Yotaro a lot more than Hanada does. You know, that's a really weird way of looking at things. <clears throat> so... Well... Oh! Lovely. in my home. Hey, you sure you're okay with this? Uh... It's fine. I don't like where this is going. I, I see. Still, the two of us being alone. N not that I have a problem with it, but... I called Hinoka to my, over to my house. I didn't say anything to Hinata. You know, she's only here for like a week. I know that she might be a little crazy. But still, that's kind of a dick move. My parents are out, so the two of us are alone. The mood felt right, so I lightly pushed Hinoka onto the bed. Okay. Okay. You know... <clears throat> there are steps to this. You don't go all the way to home. First, you gotta go through, like, first base, second base, all that sort of stuff. You don't just... What the fuck? I feel uncomfortable. Uh... Hey, stupid. What do you think you're... Ugh. Pull yourself together. Do you have a death wish? Apparently. Apparently. Oh! Oh, God. I'm not even gonna read those out loud. Nope. Nope. Oh, 
God, this just... No, no way. Ah, it's totally not it. I just... Just a little embarrassed, that's all. Seriously, what the f... You know that whole thing, whatever, Hinata said that I was a gentle guy? Apparently you can just shove that right out the fucking window. I think I might have mixed metaphors, mixed sayings there, but you get what I'm saying. Huh. Well, so long as I don't have to censor anything, we should be good. This music is not helping. What? Well, excuse me for having them in white. You're messing with me, aren't we? Aren't you? It's disturb. She's unusually okay with this. You perv. Well, I'm not gonna lie. Little bit. Huh. You know, me saying that is gonna bite me in the ass someday. Jeez, what's with that stare? If you're gonna do it, hurry up already. Well, I have no other option. Hmm. This is embarrassing. You're telling me. This is actually... This is actually my first time doing this kind of thing. What should I do? Uh... It's alright, you don't have to do it. Oh, kid. You know, the first one seems a bit more normal. It's all real. B be gentle, okay? Uh, going to beat the hell out of you. <laughs> you know, for me, that's normal. Jesus, what am I saying? Eh, nah, yeah. If I have to censor this... Uh... Well... No. Oh, Jesus. Hi. Now, Hanada, I know how this looks. Okay. Um, hmm, hmm. Yuru Taru Come on Yataru You know, I'd be completely okay if this was all a dream. A horrible, 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 horrible dream. Get up, Yataru Well, nice to see that you cleaned the blood off your face. Ah uh, Jeez, you're Finally up. Good morning. You're making a lot of noise in your sleep. Were you having a bad dream? Yeah, I dreamt that I was moving way too fast in a relationship and then you, and then you popped up and killed me. Or killed her. I'm not sure which. You were covered in blood. Or having a dirty dream. After all, look at that. What, what, look at what? You horn dog. <laughs> Like, you have any room to judge. Why are you in my room, or intruder? This is weird. Jeez, are you pl trying to play dumb? You promised we'd go on a date today. What? You're so slow to show up that I came to get you. Uh... Remind me to change my locks. It's morning, huh? That's right. It's all... all that stuff up until now was just a dream. It was all just one long, long nightmare. But Nada never transferred schools. She was still here, and we were all having fun spending our summer days together. I had told Hanada about my feelings for her. We were going out. 
In fact, it was probably fate that led me to be here with Nada. So... Yeah. This is reality. Hey, it's Aru. Wow, I am just way too easily accepting of this. How about a good morning kiss? Mm. Where's Hanoka? Something's not right. Uh... Huh? Did you say something? Hmm. It's Aru. Do you like Hanoka? No, 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 man. No, 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 no. Oh, please. That must be some sort of delusion. You're my prince. Why is the voice doing this again? There's no way you could like Hanoka. After all, we made that promise when we were kids. That's why now... Now, no one will get in our way anymore. Anymore? <laughs> so, Yataru. Could you keep your eyes on me? And only me? Hinata brought her face close to mine. The moment our lips met, I caught a glimpse of it. Behind Hinata was... Oh! <laughs> Either screaming or Mahanoka's dead. Like, I know that. That is fucked up. How did I not notice that in my room? Yeah, screaming. Screaming like seems like the appropriate reaction. Oh. You didn't clean yourself up. You were still covered in blood. Lovely. Yataru. Are you gonna run away? I had fully woken up now. Reality had thrust itself into my mind, shattering the delusion my denial had built up. What's up with outside? I ran as fast out of there as fast as I could. I had to get away as quickly as possible. <laughs> so you are going to run. Oh Jesus, she brought a sword. How'd she get that on the train? Hinata was coming after me with some sort of sword. If she catches me, I'm done for. I'm sure of it. Is this... reality? I'm just gonna say, running was a bad idea. <sighs> like, I, I'm, I'm gonna be honest, most of the decisions I'd make would have to do more with my survival. Which, in this case, would be to not run. Sit quietly until I had the chance to call the police. Without getting stabbed. Something really bad is happening. All I can do right now is keep running. I'm finished the moment my legs stop moving. I keep running. I kept running. That's right. It came to me so suddenly, I was briefly confused. All this time, I was actually together with Hanoka. Hey, Yataru, let's see which one, which of us can run faster. <laughs> chasing after you is so fun. You know, I don't mind being chased, but you're chasing me with a goddamn sword. Hey, can you hear me? And now we're in the mountains. Running out of the house. Running down the streets running through the forest into a valley. For some reason, it felt like I was being lured towards less and less populated areas. What time of day is it that no one sees this? Even though I am fran running as fast as I could and panting frantically, out, almost uh, completely out of breath, Hanada's breathing was completely normal. I wondered why that was, but I didn't have time to. <laughs> I tripped. I pathetically tripped over myself and went tumbling. God damn it. <laughs> Yatoru, I caught you. And now I'm not gonna let you get away. I wanted to run away. But my legs. My legs couldn't move another inch. Cowering and trembling, I couldn't even stand up. <laughs> Welcome to the ball, Yataru. 
Huh? You're still trying to run? I think you should give up. Probably give up now. It'll be bad for both of us if you keep trying. Don't worry. I'll make sure you get back home before the clock strikes 12. Uh, so... So just for this special occasion, I'll make sure you can't run away anymore. Oh boy. What was that movie called? The, the Stephen King movie with, uh, where the lady just, like, ties up her favorite author and then breaks his goddamn ankles? I'm having flashbacks. First, your right foot, pal. <clears throat> Not good. Wow, just as expected from a sword this sharp. <laughs> now it's time for your left foot. Oh. I need my feet. Oh, this? This is my favorite sword. I call it Masume-chan. Uh, yeah, Mas- Uh, no. Masume-chan. I hope you two get along well. Ah, uh, just the best of friends. Hi, Masume-chan, how are you? You're lying around the house, so I thought I'd take it for self-protection. On a trade! I thought it might just be a fake sword, but I guess it was real after all. Wow, I think my family might be pretty incredible. Isn't this a katana? I'm not too sure. Whoa, jeez. Too close, too close, ma'am. I always heard that katanas are super sharp, and I guess it was true. Oh, that's it. Just thought of something good. Hey, Ataru, did you know a person can live without their arms and legs? Why would you want to remove my arms? You know, the whole point is keeping me around. I can understand crippling me so I can't walk, but if I had my arms, then, you know, do more fluffy stuff, like cuddling. I'm trying to reason a way to keep my arms, is what I'm saying. Let's try it out. I need my arms. Don't worry, there's nothing to be scared of, you know, except for, except for Masumine-chan. Once you've lost your arms and legs, Hinata will do everything for you. I still want my arms. Okay then, here I go. What? You can't cut it very well because something hard is in the way. That's called bone. Oh, of course, it's bone. That's all it is. Just bone. Wow, how funny. That's why you slice at a joint. Wait, what am I saying? What? This gentle-looking angel of a girl. This blood-splattered angel. He's doing something like this? I wonder. I wonder why it all turned out this way. <laughs> in the end... In the end, Yataru, once this is all over... You're just gonna throw me in the trash. I won't have any arms to throw you away with. Oh, I know. I could. S oh, I know. I could see right through you. Have more faith in me than that, believe me. I have a hard enough time getting one person attracted to me, much less two people. Wait. Shit. Of course. I know. I've been watching you this whole time. It's true. This is pretty irrational, isn't it? Slicing off my limbs, yes. But you're the one who made the choice. Oh god. And really, you should have cho just chosen me, Yataru. Come on. You should have given the stuffed toy to me. But Bone Senpai. You gave it to Hanoka instead. Well, I did it. Well, unlike you, I wasn't worried she was going to stab Bun Senpai. <laughs> that means you're at fault. Yes. I think it's your fault. Oh, yeah. Let's just start over from the beginning. What? You know what I'm talking about, right? Oh, God, you broke the fucking fourth wall. This world is just an illusion anyway. It's fiction. You can restart it as many times as you want. 
right. So before the spell wears off, my prince, in the end, Cinderella gets her happy ending. She stays together with her prince forever. <laughs> Now, die and do it over. Yes, Ab. <laughs> True and two, Cinderella's darkness. Oh boy. So this is goodbye, Yataru. You're all you're all so sad that I'll be gone? Thank you. Huh? Get getting married? But we're five! <laughs> no, we're still in elementary school. I think it's a little too early for that. <laughs> I'm happy to hear that though, Yataru. I love you. It's a promise, got it? Don't forget. So, I'll see you. I'll see you again someday. Take care. It was a nostalgic dream. Why? Why am I remembering something like that just now? I'm sorry, Hinata. I'm sorry. So I'm guessing the first end would have happened if we gave Bun Senpai to... Well, I'm not gonna. I'm gonna finish the other two endings in the next video, and you guys will see the staff list then after that. So, yeah. Um, if you liked it, like, comment, subscribe, that's all that jazz, and I'll see you next time.